Hi, Connie from up north here. If you're new, welcome. If you're a returning viewer or subscriber, happy to have you as part of my tribe. So I have a group of girlfriends called the Cheesy Chicks. And one of the members, Jessica, has experienced a tragic loss in her life. So the Cheesy Chicks decided to say, we love you and honor you with doing an eyeshadow palette in your favorite color, blue. So with no further ado, let's all give Jessica a blue hug. So I went to gather up my uh, blue eyeshadow and I found out that I must have really been stuck in a rut as far as like just choosing neutral eyeshadow palettes because that's pretty much what I've got. I guess I thought that I was getting too old to use um, a lot of color and shimmers. But you know what? That's bull hockey. You're only as old as you feel and do what you want because make yourself happy. Color makes me happy. So no more neutral palettes for me, just simply those. I'll use them sometimes when it's appropriate. But for now on, I'm going to add color into my life. So the colors of blue that I did have, I found was I have the single, one of the single shadows of Jeffree Star. His power, I believe that is the name of that. If it's not, I'll tag it down below. And then um, I have a Mary Kay, make sure we, Mary Kay eyeshadow palette. I've got one missing, but I have three, these three shades that are in there now. I'll be using all three of those. I really like those. I think they're pretty. And then for a, a little added shimmer, right there, that blue one. So, okay, let's get started. I want to say, Jessica, I'm so sorry for the loss that you have experienced. My heart goes out for you because I know what that feels like, and I'm so sorry. So... You have a great group of friends that love you very much. And sometimes you just need a little help from your friends to get through. And you've got great friends. And so do I now. So here we go. I'm going to do this. I already put my primer on. I put my base on. Put a little bit of blush on. Did some contouring. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in there. And the first color, I like to use my... Um, I like to put my highlighter on first, so let's go ahead and do that. So I'm going to load my brush. And this Mary Kay eyeshadow goes on very nice. Oh, I like this one from the, this is the Golden Hour palette. I like that. That shimmery color right down there. What is that? That is the Reflection, and I'm going to use Infinite. Reflection and Infinite. I don't know what the colors of these are because I already took them out of the original package. But this is the Jeffree Star. That is called Power. So that's the Power. So, okay, I'll get back to it. I'm really going to put that on there because... There we go, because I'll be blending. So now I've got my got my highlighters on. I think in the corner of my eyes, I'm going to use this. I want something lighter. like Jessica taught me, drag 
tug and pull. Pat it in there. So I'm patting. Oh, I like that. Pat and drag. Let's see if I can get a better shot over here. Pat and drag. Okay, I'm happy with that in the corners. Okay, grab another brush because now I'm going to use that beautiful infinite color. See, that's why just look at it. Why just have an eyeshadow palette that you can just look at with it. Just look at and say, um, oh, I love that, but be too afraid to, to wear it. That's not happening anymore with me. Okay. Oh, look at that. I love it. I've got to be really careful not to get too messy with it. So I kind of did this a little backwards just because I wanted to see what it would look like on the actual eyeshadow, so I need to blend that into there. I want that to blend into that corner color, so. All right, let me get a blending brush. Yeah, I like it. I think it's pretty. All right, I'm going to use that power in my crease. Brush them off. I don't know how pigmented Jeffree Star's eyeshadows are usually very... Oh, I don't like that size of blending brush. Grab some more here. Can somebody tell me what this brush is for? I have it in my arsenal, but I have no idea what to do with it. If you could tell me what to do, I know I'd make happy trees with that if I was doing a, an acrylic painting, but I really don't know what to do with it as far as eyeshadow goes. I'd love to know though. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do little circular motions. Get that in my crease. It's nice when you meet people that inspire you to come out of your comfort zone a little bit. And that's exactly what the Cheesy Chicks have done. Definitely. I did a uh, 420 collaboration with Beth and, and uh, Barbara from Barbara's Beauty Bag. And I hadn't used green before. That was the first time I'd ever used green on my in my eyeshadow. So, and I'll be honest with you, I think this may. I I usually I usually go with purples and things like that. So for me to be using blue here, this is definitely out of my comfort zone, but I like it. Actually, yeah. Let me see. Let me blend that. I have this really cool blending brush that I've does the job. So I got messages that a couple of the band members were sick, so I Really don't know how many people are going to be down there today. No matter. I'll still play you a song. So let's go back into... I'm going to go back into this lighter color. This golden color. I think yellow and blue are the prettiest. The 
prettiest colors together. I think that yellow and blue look stunning together. So that's why I decided there we go with that. Packing it in there, like Jessica told me. Yeah, I'm digging that. So I'm going to take the blue eyeshadow and I'm gonna put that on the outside of the corners of my eyes. Just like so. Up a little bit into the crease area. I actually, I really like this. I'm just gonna pack it up there. Now, I'll take a nice blending brush. Bring that up and in, up and in. I'm quite, actually, I'm real happy with that. I love the blue. I think that looks so pretty. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure I've got everything on that I want. Actually, I'm real happy with that. All right. Let me go slap on some uh, eyeliner and some mascara, and uh, um, I'll finish this look. No, wait a minute. No, I will. I'm gonna go slap on some uh, eyeliner and mascara, and I'm really happy with this. I love it. Get out of your comfort zone. Sometimes you can surprise yourself and do something really beautiful. Be right back. So it's a dark, dreary day up here in northern Michigan, and a pop of color was just what the doctor ordered. It's so nice. Sometimes friends can encourage you to do different things than what you're used to, and that's just what happened with me today. I needed this pop of color. Jessica, I'm so sorry for the loss, and it was, I'm honored to be part of this to let you know that. Our hearts are with you, and if there's anything I can do, I'm always here for you. I'm always here for all of you. So, I'll see you soon.